Welcome back to Let's Play Ganbari Goemon for the Nintendo DS. And last time we just beat Lantern Man. And we are continuing our pursuit of Admiral Paruri. After we kill freaky red demon things that scream like monkeys. And adamant chestnuts? <laughs> Strange enemies. Too bad you can't eat the chestnuts. And why there are giant drums rolling down this hill, I do not know. And the game never explains it either. little mushroom enemies, you have to knock their cap off first with the stylus, and then whack them. Hey, it's the artist guy! Inside a creepy cottage in the woods. That's not suspicious. So basically, the artist kid is has been offered all this food by the old old lady over there. However, we have a suspicion that the old lady is not who she appears to be. We will come back to that later. Bisumaru is kind of cute in the ballerina dress. I've been playing with Yae a lot, so I'm gonna go back and play with Goemon some now. It's just been a while. I hate how those things scream like monkeys. They're so weird. of dead sea creatures around. Including the best uh, healing item in the game and the next upgrade of armor. A little fish cake thing will uh, fully heal you. So we have three healing items now. And of course a thief, as in every town. Octopus. Treasure chest. Money. Elephant. Huh. The map over there is kind of weird. Doesn't look like it goes anywhere. Nothing like our world. Or Scary Mod's world is not exactly natural. Because you have walking chestnuts. So we are trying to find clues as to where the next uh, mystical object object is. And 
I just got hit twice in a row. I lost all my weapon upgrades. Because I'm stupid. I suck at this game. This area is just really annoying. I don't know why. Just because there's like a lot of jumping and stuff. Oh, and then that happens. A lot. Because I am retarded. <sighs> I still blame the keyboard. to like take my hands off the keyboard and actively go over and use the mouse which is definitely not as intuitive as the style of some of actual DS so it's kind of annoying really of course I get hit again right away I get another kitty again right away I love Yai's carp outfit. Oh my. So cute. I was just checking to see if there was something other than there, but it's just that monster. Black going on. Come away. Here we have the spirit of a dead samurai. As it turns out this uh, samurai spirit has the mystical katana that Admiral Periri is looking for. And in order uh, to get it, he wants his uh, uh, helmet back. But he is not able to get it because it's located in the land uh, where Amaratsu and Okay, Amaratsuru? I am not pronouncing it right. It's the Japanese sun goddess. Um, you play as an Okami. And I cannot remember how to pronounce that name off the top of my head right now. And I'm not going to look it up. Because I'm lazy. Yep. Amaratsuru? That's it. It's been too long. Oh, and he gives Yae a uh, upgrade for her bazooka, which lets you target multiple enemies at once. Which is very useful. If you have the money for it. So it eats up your Rio really fast. getting back is a little bit easier. Just a little bit. And I will waste the next minute or so looking for Elephant in all the wrong spots, so watch me jump around randomly. Whee! you 
some healing now. Mr. Goemon! He does not look happy to see us. Anyway, he gives us a tip about how we can get to uh, the place where we need to go to find the Samurai Spirit's helmet. And we will head there next time on Let's Play Ganbari Goemon DS. See you then!